Heart, come. Heart, you came back. What a good girl. Who's a good girl? It's you, Heart. You're the best girl. Yes, you are. <laughs> I'm so happy. I love you, Heart. I always knew Eileen was the woman of my dreams. Mm -hmm. But it's nice to have it confirmed. All the pieces are in place. I was just about to leave, but now I think I'll stay after all. Yes, I'll be able to stay here indefinitely. As long as the host survives. Wait, 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 what? Oh man, that's messed up. Mind over matter. Sir, there's been an incident. An incident? Uh, a crash, sir. And the subject is missing. Why are you coming to me for instructions? Obviously, I'm going to tell you to find it. It's the most powerful weapon in the universe. Spaghetti! Spaghetti in my, my head! Spaghetti in my head. <laughs> wow! What a crazy dream! Oh, good thing dreams are stupid and don't mean anything! You're awake! Perfect. That'll be a lot easier than carrying you out. Huh? What will be easier than carrying me out? This. Get out! What? Your insurance doesn't cover head injuries, mister. Get out! Head injury? <laughs> what? What happened to my head? Hey, she hey, quit shoving! Will oh, you just sucks, tell me what buddy. happened to my head? Get hey, hey, out. hey, easy on the buns! Look at that guy. He's just having a good old time. Looks like he's stealing a foot. This is a pretty nifty game. Ah, this bandage is all kinds of itchy. Ah! I should just tell it to him straight. Oh, this can't be happening. Ouch! No. <laughs> Careful, I will bet you. I will do it right so on the So shiny. Become a so ship, say shit. Your patron I can't do it without it. Holy crap. Ooh, what, what the hell? The okay. Okay, I'm My controller's talking to me. Arms don't grow out of heads. I just gotta get home and sleep this off. It, it's all a hallucination, that, that's all. It's uh, just a hallucination that lets me read minds accurately. So let's go back over here then, because there might be something. No, maybe not. Got a little waggy tail thing. Spaghetti sticking out of my head. Mom spaghetti. Hop over this stuff. Uh, random cars. Hey, listen, do me a favor. I kinda didn't think this through. Obviously. And I left the handbrake on in the car. Could you disengage it for me? Uh, actually, maybe you can do me a favor instead. I'm looking for a cab ride home, and... I got my own problems here. Problems I do not want to talk about. Listen, thanks for nothing. I'm just gonna wait here till somebody else comes and disengages my car. Peace! Maybe... I... Maybe I can use my hallucination brain arm to read his mind and find out what his problem is. Barbara, if only you hadn't left me for that mafia don with the mad nutty smile. If only my own smile had that sparkle that drives you wild. 
If only I could take back years of poor dental hygiene. If only I could have you back. <laughs> That's I gotta nuts. find a way to help this dude get his lady friend back. Keep it up, Barbara. We'll win this competition for sure. Especially since my biggest challenger had an unfortunate accident. What? Huh? What was that? Sorry, I was kind of lost in your teeth there. I just love your smile, Don. Uh, Don's my position, not my ne uh, You know what, uh, Don's fine. Honey, I don't care what you're called, as long as you keep showing me those sparkly teeth. What the fuck? Chick is obsessed with teeth? That's fucking weird. Can't stop this dance train. Uh. Red, where are you? Are you? We've been. Ed, where are you? We've been practicing for weeks, and you promised you wouldn't stand me up. Don't do this to me, Eddie. Hold on me. I'm a funny something. I am an adult human, and my major criteria in selecting a mate is how shiny their teeth are. I may have made some bad decisions somewhere. However, on the other hand, ooh, shiny teeth. Someone on kick is weird as hell. Some might say that murdering a man to win a dance competition is sociopathic. But is it really sociopathic to only see people as obstacles to be overcome by any means possible? <sighs> Wait. Maybe it is. Maybe that's actually the textbook symptom of sociopathy. Oh well. Too late now. Poor Bitey. All alone and lost in the sewer. Nobody to tuck him in at night. Nobody to give him his belly rubs and his teeth scratches. Bitey's such a gentle soul. He needs me to take care of him. I love with these people and teeth, man. Bitey, here, buddy. I've got your favorite treat. Everybody tree. wants the teeth. Chicken. Chicken. I'm nature's greatest predator, buddy. And I'm tired of chicken. I got a taste for special treats, and I ain't coming out for anything except human limbs, baby. Delicious human limbs, so long and crunchy, so full of valuable vitamins and minerals. <laughs> what in the world is up with this game? I've got your favorite treat. Teeth, gators, and sewers. What is up with this? Map. Alright, let's solve these people's problems this first. Come get it, buddy! Let me see if I can figure out how to interact with this guy. Can't interact. Mm, I can't wait to eat all this chicken myself! Unless. Dude, if I can run back to oh boy, hanging by a rope. Bob, 
This can't be real, can it? I thought we'd be together forever. Forever! Oh, I can't believe our relationship is over. And a crazy day together forever. I hate to see him hurt, but it had to be done. Right? It had to be done. Breakups suck, but I still care for him. I just wish everything didn't have to be so sucky. <laughs> Oh, what a kind and noble heart here breaks. Oh gosh, yeah, okay. Rachel's gonna kill me if I don't make it to the disco competition on time. Only she won't, because I'll already be dead. Because these guys are gonna kill me real soon. This is it, Ed. You're going to be dead soon, and you never went skydiving. You never ate caviar, and you never beat the Silver Surfer game for the NES. Ugh. You're gonna die with regrets, Ed. Oh, if only I'd spent more time learning that how to escape from game. trunks instead of learning the enemy attack patterns in the Silver Surfer for the NES. <laughs> Although, honestly, I'm glad I spent so much time playing Silver Surfer for the NES. No. The game was tight. No. I, I, the game is bad. As soon as little Mario could walk, he'd be over every day to say hi to Beatrice. And he, and he was always so excited to see him. He'd bark and bark and bark. Just, just endless frantic barking from Beatrice. <laughs> yes, sir. Nice. I can't be real, can it? Strange day. Please don't ask about the <laughs> I never forget a smell. Those are the jerks that tortured me every day when I was a puppy. Ah! They tied firecrackers to my tail. Gosh darn it. I'd eat them alive if only I had my teeth. I need teeth, darn it. What? I I so bad. <sighs> it's good to be the big brother. <laughs> Still fickle. I have to do the hard labor while my big brother stands around and smokes. Hooray! You got born ten seconds earlier. That definitely means you have to never work a day in your life. Oh yes, absolutely. I deserve to be the guy mixing the concrete. Heck, if I didn't want to do that, I would have pushed my way to the front line 30 years ago, right? Why? I, hey, what's the big idea? Get any closer and I'll get my brother to beat you up. Understand? Hey, what's the big idea? Get any closer and I'll get my brother to beat you up. Understand? Okay. Guess I can't cut up that. Ooh. Thingy. Where does this thing go? Where do you go, thingy? Thingy. I have a thingy. I don't know where it goes. I wonder if it goes over here. Well, it was worth a shot. Keith that won't you, maybe. Um, where? Here? Anything? Maybe? Ooh, another thingy. Ingredient parfait! This meal, it is. Uh, perfection! Perfection! You can really taste this sorrow. No, stolen. <laughs> it's a new piece de resistance! 
so I am lying in the gutter of this restaurant and its swine patrons. I can nevertheless show them the stars. Homeboy, you cook like limbs, man. You can't be cooking limbs. Whitey, you came back. Come on, let me hug you for a bit. Laura and the kids will be ecstatic to see you again. They may show it by screaming at us and running away, but that's just their way. He's got hooks for arms. Stolen teeth. Oh, baby. I feel empty inside. Inside my mouth, anyway. I just don't understand wives and children like I understand crocodiles. Whitey, you don't judge me for coming home with chicken blood on me and smelling like I've literally been standing in a sewer for hours. Yeah. Anyway, let's go back up here. If I can. Get up there. Random dude with singing. And How's it work? Oh, dog teeth. Dog teeth go over there. for the competition. How can I ever say thanks? Well, I, I could use a drive. Got it. I'll dance for you, and then we can talk about Silver Surfer. Oh, uh, no. The NES? Aw, oh, man, I really want to talk about this, but I'm late. Ed, you made it. Where were you? Locked in a trunk, but this stranger wandered in and helped me out. Oh, it's been a good day for that, I think. Let's dance. An amazing set. First place goes to Rachel and Ed for their routine, Rachel's Education in Dance. This is an outrage. I paid good money to ensure my victory. Ah, I'm so angry, I could swallow my teeth. I could literally swallow my teeth. I'll save you, Don. I'll save you, Don's teeth. Okay, that was weird as hell. Ed, buddy, it's been a long, strange day. But you're ending it in a crazy dance scene. So I think things worked out pretty okay. It's time to shake my bod and chew gum. And actually, I'd much prefer to shake my bod than chew gum. So this is working out well. Don's actually kind of gross. And really old and I've got nothing in common with him he's lost that sparkle somehow oh, you can't stop this dance train my mouth feels lighter like there's, there's fewer teeth in it somehow Good. So sparkly. Have some old man they teeth. feel good. They feel right. What am I doing here? I need to go show Barbara. He just bent his Barbara, neck back and did I'm the rope. Back, and I got a mouthful to say to you. Bernie, is that you? He's got old You're man so teeth in his mouth. Sparkly. That's oh, so strange. Bernie. Where did we go wrong? We didn't, Barbara. Just forget it. Everything up to now is non-canon. Canonicity starts right now. And his neck is like extra elongated. Thanks for the ride home, Bernie. 
Thanks for reminding me what's really important. Love. Sparkly Apparently teeth. not to her. Yeah, it's teeth to her. She only gives a shit about the teeth. Finally, just a few jumps away from home, where I can put all these hallucinatory spaghetti arms and oddly accurate mind reading guy. behind me. Aline, I'm home. I've had the craziest day, honey. Uh, check it out. Think of a number between negative gazillion and infinity plus three. Bet you 50 bucks I can. Eileen, I know that the arm sticking out of my head looks weird. The what? Uh, the arm sticking out of my head. Uh, I know it looks weird, uh, but... There's it... no arm sticking out of your head. Ray, are you going nuts on me? Are you dropping insanity balls on the floor? No, I... Oh, I don't think so. You really can't see it? Insanity Sweetie, why balls. why don't you go see my shrink? Nice. Dr. Egglesworth helped me a lot. Dropping insanity balls I'm not balls afraid of grapes anymore, see? She's afraid of grapes. Oh, Maybe I am crazy. I guess it wouldn't hurt to see Dr. Egglesworth. How are you afraid of grapes? I believe his office is over here, uh, to the right. I don't want to go to the right. I want to go to the left. <laughs> ah, that's him! He's the one who took your sacred thing of a bomb! I know because he has a stupid haircut. I don't forget a haircut that dumb. <laughs> oh man, what a Agent mean old dude. Reporting in. We may that have guy's a got a stupid haircut. Instructions. I don't forget Get stupid him. haircuts. Good grief. Uh oh. Wait, is this real? Am I like... being chased by these jerks? Or am I really just going totally nuts right now? Oh, Dr. Ecclesworth, if only you hadn't taken the death of your father so hard and fallen into deep depression. I'm glad you're seeing Dr. Brom. I'm also glad I'm paid by the hour. Take as long as you need, Dr. Ecclesworth. Huh. I guess my psychiatrist needs a psychiatrist. Uh oh. Is he gonna literally come up and get me? Oh, yes he is! Oh, run! Oh, no, I died. <laughs> oh man, first death. an inconvenience for me, but it's not going to shut down my practice. There's still tons of people out there who need lobotomies. Stay away from me with your lobotomies, man. <laughs> so you're not as scary as I was expecting. I'm not scary. I'm a lobotomist. And it's the only way to cure what ails you, Sonny. A few cuts, a few slips, and you won't have a care in the world. Oh, yeah. When has talking about your issues ever solved anything? Action speaks louder than words, and that action is cutting out brain parts! I wouldn't get... <laughs> yeah, that's what everybody needs. Just cut out the brain. Kind of... come on. Please. Get... That's a gentleman who loves digging six-foot deep holes. This is basically the perfect job for me. Except for the constant and omnipresent threat of a spooky hunting. Why does he have to sound Russian? 
Anyway. Keep... Oh man, I almost didn't. Come and get me, guy. Yoink. No, come on, come on, come on. Oh, duped ya. You duped me! <laughs> he duped me. I've been duped. Bah. How do you... Ah. Hey, those guys are snappily dressed! Oh my god! <laughs> maybe, maybe I should mind read them. <laughs> well, I should have not stayed up all night last night eating burritos, and yet I have no regrets about staying up all night eating burritos. Oh man! What happens if I put this sticker on an agent? God, great. <laughs> Sweet! This sticker makes them sleepy. Oh, what I the probably fuck? don't have too long until they wake up. <laughs> I can sticker sleep oh, people. This is heavy. I gotta get to that psychiatrist stat. <laughs> Mr. Copy. Such a peer. Ooh, I knew it. And uh, excuse me, uh, doctor. Um, doctors. Doctor Brom, I can't go back to work. I just can't. Dad hated how I practiced my profession, and now that he's gone, we'll never reconcile. There's no closure left for me. I'll never be able to talk to him again. Mm-hmm. And how does that make you feel? Sad, I guess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And how, how does, does that, that make, make you, you feel? feel? The sadness? No, um, like, not happy? Like, I have emotions that are making me depressed. How do you describe mm -hmm. that? How do you describe and even how that? How does that make you feel? Wait, how does that make you feel? Fine, thank you, but we're here to discuss you. Dang! <laughs> I gotta help Dr. Ecclesworth so that he can help dick. me! I gotta cure his depression staff! Wow, it worked get a lot easier when I realized I could ask. And how does that make you feel? To every question! This man? If only I could talk to my dad one more time. Get him to understand why I do what I do. I just need one last chat with him. Man, I don't need a psychiatrist. I need a medium. Or at least a necromancer. Wait, necromancers don't really exist, do they? No, uh, I think they're all frauds. Mm -hmm. Okay, medium it is. Oh, yeah. I'm just... Medium. Yes, I have made contact with the Irony. spirit of your dear departed wife. I haven't departed anywhere. I can't move in the afterlife because my husband cut off my legs. Yada! Is she here? Can you ask her if she's mad that I cut off her legs? She's saying that she is, um... Slightly frustrated by the circumstances. If I could touch him, I'd tear his legs off too! Yeah, <laughs> definitely sensing some frustration. Just a little frustration. I can't walk into the light or anywhere else for that matter. Either someone needs to find me some legs, or someone needs to kill a wheelchair and send its ghost over my way. After I apologize for cutting off her legs, I should ask her if she knows where I put my rabbit. I haven't seen him for weeks. And rabbits don't just disappear. Oh, wait, no. 
I made him disappear and then couldn't get him back. Okay, yeah, note to self. Stop by pet store on the way home. He's got the rabbit in his How friggin' How amazing hat. it is that ghosts really do exist. And how incredible that they all want to talk with my paying customers. At least this ghost knows our language. I'm so tired of being bothered by cavemen ghosts from thousands of years ago. Okay, let's keep Balloons going. for sale! Balloons for sale! I've taken some of our planet's finite helium supply and put it inside a leaky disposable balloon. You should buy it! <laughs> yes! So what do I do with the helium? There. That doesn't work. No. Ooh. What? What? There. That won't stick. No. Who else needs helium? Oh, it fell! <laughs> no! <laughs> I fell down. No! No, get away from me! No! Okay, I can't. I guess I can't go back that way. So, somebody over here needs helium then. So what the hell? Who needs the helium? That doesn't work. That won't work. I don't understand what this is for. There's something up there. That, that doesn't stick. work. Leaky disposable balloon. You should buy it! Let me buy balloon. Okay. Um, I need to get over... back to, to the father, but... it won't let me... Won't let me go. That doesn't work. That doesn't work, apparently. Where do I go? Game, I am in need of assistance. Cause yeah, I can't jump into that guy. Cause that kills me. And I can't. Oh no! That was that was not supposed to happen. Okay. Um. No. God. <laughs> yes, come and get me. Bah. Can I like? I can't jump over him. Okay. What the fuck? Can I like? Is there an action? Can I? Mind read him. God damn it. Stupid. Smack him with your brain. <sighs> Grab. Thingy, don't. Oh my gosh. No. That's not what I. Oh my gosh. Here we go. This is where we start to mess up. No. No. I, uh, I had it the one time, like he was... I need to like... Put... <laughs> Whoa! I should have not stayed up all night last night eating burritos! And yet I have no regrets about staying up all night eating burritos. Yeah, now let me grab his little thought bubble thingy. 
Well, no. Let me, let me grab the thingy. Thank you. Fuck that stupid shit over there. Let me smack him in the face with his leapy self. Okay. Oh no. Come here, buddy. Yep. Can't catch me. I am gingerbread man. Okay. Now I have gas. What is the gas for? Uh oh. That's death. Okay. <laughs> I forgot about that jump. <laughs> Oh man, I have helium. I can't jump over him. I wonder if I can lag jump. Let's the game over. Okay, I can't lag jump. Lag jumping doesn't exist. Can I fall climb? <laughs> Maybe I can fall climb it. Nope, okay, I can't fall climb. Can I do this. Let me try this. D grab the ledge. Oh man. Grab the ledge. D <laughs> yeah. Can I can't do that. What about over here? There's a guy there. There's uh, nothing else back that way. So where does this... Okay, so where does this foolishness go then? Zoink. I know I recognize Zoink. So yeah, these are the creators. So high five to you guys. My bad. I don't. Yeah, it's just my bad. Here you go, guys. Way to go. You did make a very, very good game. Like, I'm very much enjoying this game. It's, well, confusing a little bit, but I'm getting the hang of it. I love the art style too. That's pretty much what drew me into the game was the art style. And then everything else I'm just figuring out as I go along. And it made me the man I am today! Jeez, that was an incredibly dumb haircut. When I catch Ray, I'm gonna get a free swim for me and a guest in the company swimming pool. A savings of over four ninety five. <laughs> Only four ninety five. Oh, Dr. Ecclesworth, if only... Yeah, I've already... Who needs this stupid helium? How does one helium? I don't Man, get it. I really should... Oh, no. Hey, buddy, get out of here. I don't want to play with you. Ah. 
jump to my death. I'm so confused on this frigging helium man. Man, I really should have looked longer for a part-time job. This is embarrassing. Bah. Oh, I escaped because you suck at life. So who needs this frigging stuff, man? I don't get it. When has talking about your issues ever making can't give these guys anything. Ah. Ah. Come and get me. Oh, but I dupe you. And then I climb out of your reach. Stupid, stupid stuff. <laughs> that won't stick. If only I could talk to my Wow, you working. Need a thingy. Dr. Burns Mom's office. Sticker. Won't that stick the work. helium. Why do I need the fucking work. helium then? <laughs> Maybe it's for later, but I can't even... Like, I don't even know how to get up there. Stop waving at me. Maybe I'm dumb and didn't fucking jump up here. Ah, Jace, the greatest show on earth. As long as you don't let yourself be led by Danny for the little guy. Normally people say bully like it's a bad thing. But have they tried it? It rules! I have no doubt. If my legs were longer, I wouldn't get punched. I could run away to freedom. I could follow my dreams of being in library school instead of this degrading show. <laughs> Punches make me feel good. All right, round 37. Whoever has the shortest legs gets punched. Again. Ready, Gigator? Ready, Colossus? Ready, little chump? What? No! No! One, two, three, go! Wait! No, wait! No! Oh! Oh! my gosh, are they... Hey, Jace! Jace! They're about to pull off the rally scene, trembling, trembling, maneuver! Ladies and gentlemen, this trick is very difficult to pull off. Let's watch. A complete success and a very painful landing for little Trump. Ha! Poetry and push That won't stick. Well, it was worth a shot. Wrong sticker. Well, it was worth a shot. Well, it was worth a shot. Oh, the commission. Oh, that's why it's not the commission. Oh, that's why it's not the commission. <laughs> no, get away from me. Burn, burn! Who has a cold heart now? Burn, burn, burn! Fire, burn! All right. Jump, Sonny! You're leaving the crowds waiting. The show must go on. Dad, I'm scared. I told you, I'm afraid of heights. They're not <laughs> heights once you hit the bottom. Jump, dang it. Dad, I don't want to fall to my death. Please stop hitting my hands. Next time, I'm not bringing the inflatable hammer. Jump. Jump right now! Come on, we're not that high up! Oh my god! Okay, I guess that's what it's for. I can't if I let go, I'll die! Help me, please! Dad, 
I'll die! Oh great, now I'm gonna die and my dad is a balloon! That second fortune cookie I got was also right! I need to stop eating at Crazy Jack's crazy but insanely accurate fortune cookie restaurant! <laughs> Why can I not jump on the thing? I like it when the cannon makes the fire come out and I'm inside the explosion. I once again past several last night eating for more grid of I mean I confess I cannot see the attraction to being fired out of a cannon. But I do see the attraction of being responsible for the safety of those who do choose this path. So I need the fire dude. Okay, that makes sense now. Alright, so I need the fire dude. So I'm with the fire guy. Gotta steal fire from the fire guy. Cause there. That thing go boom. Hit that guy. Oh, that was awesome. I uh, think. So what now? Did that not do anything? I know it did. Okay, target. So what now? What am I doing with the target? What the fuck? Did that go there? That won't stick. stick that there. Oh! I'm a dummy dumb. Big ol' stupid dumb face. Maybe this... Oh! No. <laughs> Put that there. No, okay. <laughs> so that doesn't work then. I'm not a stupid dumb face. Maybe well, no, that shot. doesn't work. Put it inside uh, a leaky shut up, woman. Don't want your balloons. That, Wrong no. Um, is there anything past the Ferris wheel? No. Is there anything above the Ferris wheel? Yes, there is something above the Ferris wheel. Let's go above the Ferris wheel. Leap, and a leap, and uh, we'll go this way, maybe? Oh, okay, we won't go that way. This way, hopping up, jumping, jumping, jumping. Ah, almost made it. Damn it. Try again. Here we go. Up, jump, jump, jump. I did the thingy. That's not fair. Stupid hand. Alright, come on down. Ha! <sighs> He's so fast! He's so fast! Come on, you stupid bastard. Let's go. Come on! Fucking come and get me, dick! Got away! My dude does the fucking animation, but he grabs. Stupid, dumb fuck. God damn it. Come here, you prick. Fuck you. Fuck you and your stupidness. Jerk bag, motherfucker. Ugh. Uh, excuse me. Oh, yes, hello. Well, take a good Beard look. lady. Here I am, the bearded lady. Isn't that crazy? Doesn't that mess with your ideas of gender and beauty? I... I guess? Well, soak it up, because there's no rebels. What the fuck? Easiest jam in the world. It's amazing what a little super glue, a shaved dog, and a lot of patience can do. I'll mix it. Easiest jam in the world. Glue. What the, what the hell? 
Sometimes. Oh man. No, I don't want to go there. Come on, you stupid bastard. Let's go around again. Oh. That's actually better because I can go this way. It's faster. hanging here together. This is the best trick ever! This is perfect! You're perfect! We'll never do that old trampoline trick again! This blows it out of the water! I'm so happy! I love you, son! Okay, stole his teeth. It's like the second pair of teeth that I just stole. I don't get this. Game's obsession with teeth. Go through this. Come out here. No! Okay, maybe these teeth do go here. I don't know. Check it out. Uh, that won't okay, stick. that didn't go there. No. Oh, this mouth is so he happy! Only the nicest things could come out of a mouth this happy. Delightful. This is super glue. Like, really? I wonder what else I can steal from this lady. Easiest jam in the world. Can I, like... Easiest jam in the world. It's amazing what a little super glue, a shave dog, and a lot of patience can do. Let me take the this other... This is super glue. I don't want the super glue no more. I don't know what it's for. Am I supposed to use something? I don't know what it's freaking for. Wait, what? One more ah. impulse, the trampoline triplets maneuver! Put your backs into it, boys! Oh, Not a problem! You know that. Get ready to have your mind's body slammed! Not again! Wait a second! Your legs are tinier than mine! You've been faking this for years, Gigator! Library school, here I come! Oh, oh, oh wrestling slash bullying. What is a library school? Anyway, 
take your freaking legs. Shut up, you. I don't want to buy balloons. Stick the fucking legs there. Perfect. Legs out of nowhere. This will definitely be all I need in my eternal afterlife. Goodbye, sweetie. I loved you more than I love even magic itself. Which is too bad, because if I studied magic harder, you wouldn't have died. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad that's done. So, handsome, how long do you think it'll be before you get back into dating? Oh, I don't know. A few minutes? Well, that'd be cool. Damn. She's like, a few minutes? Okay, let me grab. My wife wouldn't want me to grieve for too long, right? She'd probably think it was way cool if I kissed on somebody I just paid money to. I think that's what she would do for sure. It's against my professional code to flirt with patrons, but something about him is just magic. <laughs> no pun intended. What is up with these freaking teeth? Let me grab the thingy because I know that I'm. Give me, let me, just give me this. Give me. Okay, I got it. Hop up here. Hop up there. Bam. And how does that make you feel? I've pulled back the veil between our world and the next one. What? Huh? Are there any spirits with which you would like to speak? Dad, I want to talk to my dad. He looks a little like me, only he's super old. Ghost of the Sky's old dad, I command you. <laughs> Ghost of the Sky's old dad. Who called me? Dad, it's me. I. I just wanted to talk to you. To make peace about how you love lobotomies, and I love treating people without cutting into their skulls. Son, I. I. I have a mind to lobotomize you right here! You've been losing this argument for years! And now, even when I'm dead, you drag me back so you can get one last word in? Of all the selfish, self interested, totally deserving of a lobotomy actions to do! And Let that smile thing, on. I. He looks like the I Joker. Even I'd be more freaked out about that than a dad yelling at me for being in a profession that I like. Want to see people That's sad. straight creepy right there. You're doing good, son. And I'm proud of you. You Look know that, right? Shadow in I the background. Know. Look at this ghost shadow. That's my cue. Look at it. You'll be good, boy. It doesn't Hooray! connect. There's no mouth. The Joker no, teeth sir. don't exist in the what? shadow. What happened? What I miss? I talked to my dad! And that guy's shadow looks like a frog. Things out. I can go back to work now, thank you! <laughs> what? Ghosts? Oh, that's crazy talk. You're crazy. What? No, I'm not crazy. He was a vision from beyond the grave. I'm not crazy! <sighs> Next! I... I guess that's me. Excellent, excellent. Uh, sit down here. And tell me all about how whatever your issue is makes you feel. Oh, well, I've, I've got this giant spaghetti arm that comes out of my head. And only I can see it. Oh, but it, but it lets me read people's minds. Telepathy, huh? <laughs> Definitely sounds crazy. Ooh, but before I give you my diagnosis, uh, uh, there's one thing I'd like to try. Follow the pendulum. You are getting sleepy. You are about to tell me all your secrets. No. Hey. He's using a bullet. Sleepy. That's not sleepy, that's creepy! That man is creepy! So creepy. Hey, 
I would not go here? to him because that man creepy. Land. Don't worry. Just behave. He's got a crooked head way. too. Knowing Look at him. That I am always a frog guy. Watch it and silently judging. Ah, sweet. I'm gonna wrap this game up at we've been playing for a little more than an hour so we're gonna wrap this game up here and then I'm gonna switch over to my next game so stay tuned for that you know you guys are gonna see a little bit of an interruption but that's okay you're still going to be able to hear my voice. I'm going to tell you exactly what's going on. I'm menuing right now. Yes, menus. Let's see. Um.